humanity in various ways. The official launch which took place in Abuja had members of the diplomatic corps represented together with representatives of the various Red Cross societies such as the British Red Cross and the Norwegian Red Cross. Others are the International Federation of the Red Cross, IFRC, the International Committee of the Red Cross, the media and other civil society organizations. The national president, while explaining the essence of the launch, said it is aimed at addressing the huge gap in funding for the Red Cross in Nigeria, and Nigeria, being a major stakeholder, should rise to the occasion. Put on a good uh, percentage, we assume a percentage of about 70% of uh, present rate of vulnerability. Uh, we are foreclosing that there might be arising some few challenges, maybe because of uh, climate change uh, issues, and some other unforeseen circumstances that we might not be thinking about now. Uh, we all pray against disasters, but they do occur. Uh, if they come, you know, we see how people at the local level that can rise up to certain levels of emergencies, if they come beyond the plan of action that we have. Having some penetration into difficult or hard to reach areas uh, in terms of uh, conflict situations or in terms of even uh, threats on that. On his part, the head of delegating and country cluster for Bene, Ghana, Nigeria and Togo, Bupinda Toma, said over $63 billion is needed by the Red Cross in Nigeria to effectively address its mandate, hence the need for the launch. Uh, Nigeria Red Cross wants to serve uh, more than 10 million people uh, that are impacted by various crises in, in, in Nigeria. And it is requesting that it needs about $63 million to be able to do that. The biggest part of this money or these resources that we are asking for will go to serving the humanitarian impact of the various vulnerabilities in Nigeria. That means that the crisis in Northeast so I think we are saying that we want to serve about a million people in the, in the Northeast that are impacted by the various challenges that are happening in the Bay States and surrounding the Bay States. But the largest part of our contribution is actually for the hunger. As you heard in Nigeria, including the president of, uh, of the country, has declared uh, a hunger, a national emergency. And if this is because you know, 30 million people will be impacted by hunger this year in Nigeria. And we are asking for $33 million to see how we can use those resources and pass on to the most vulnerable here in Nigeria. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.